Hello, I'm Florina Montanescu for The Developer Show. This is your weekly update on the cooler developer news from Google. Motion Editor is a visual design editor for the motion layout layout type, making it easier to create and preview animations in your Android app. We just released the stable version of Motion Editor in Android Studio 4.0, and we already see many developers using it to build animations. For a quick tour of the new Motion Editor and how to use the latest features during your animation development, check out the post linked in the YouTube description below or by swiping up on Instagram. We're excited to announce Private Service Connect in Alpha, which allows you to connect and consume first and third party as well as customer-owned services easily and privately. In short, Private Service Connect allows you to simplify connectivity to services, protect your network traffic, and accelerate cloud migrations. You can find out how to get started on the post. Like all developers, you want the confidence that your next deployment will be healthy. That's why Cloud Run, our fully managed container compute platform, now allows you to have more control over the rollout of your changes. You can decide to manually split traffic between revisions, allowing you to gradually roll out revisions or roll back to an older version. Check out the post for an example of gradual rollout and rollback with Cloud Run. TensorFlow 2.3 has been released. The focus of this release is on new tools to make it easier for you to load and pre-process data and to solve input pipeline bottlenecks, whether you're working on one machine or many. Check out the What's New in TensorFlow 2.3 post to read about the new features in tf.data and the TF profiler, plus experimental support for the new Keras pre-processing layers API. Please remember to like, subscribe, and share. I'm Florina Montanescu for The Developer Show. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next week. And this is your weekly news from Something Something.